people who have chronic kidney disease need to be careful about their diets. One of our viewers wants to know if I have some suggestions for someone who has chronic kidney disease and has to limit protein, phosphorus, and potassium. So let's just talk about what happens. When your kidneys are working fine and they're healthy, they help get rid of wastes in your body. But when they're not working, that function is impaired. So certain nutrients like potassium and phosphorus may need to be limited. Um, let's start with potassium. Potassium is found in all kinds of good for you foods. Um, so you have to be careful because you still want that nutritional goodness, but you have to be careful about the amount. You'll find potassium in fruits and vegetables and dairy. So for something like an avocado, maybe you would just have a smaller portion. So you still want to enjoy them, but enjoy those nu nutrient rich foods in lesser quantities. Um, of course, you need to work with your dietitian and your doctor very closely to determine what's the right diet for you because even though there are broad generalizations it is very individualized now when it comes to phosphorus that's a mineral that's also found in many foods and foods like milk and cheese and beans and peas and nuts and peanut butter again nutritious foods so you, if you're undergoing dialysis, you might be allowed to have milk, but you might only be able to have about a half a cup a day. Again, you have to work with your dietitian to figure out what's the right meal plan for you. And protein, protein is so vitally important. Um, and you have to eat high quality protein because proteins will help keep your muscles and repair, keep your muscles strong and repair tissue. And your body breaks down protein and so we want to make sure that you're eating enough, but not too much, and you're eating the right kind of high quality protein. So high quality protein, fish and eggs and dairy um, and lean meats, those are all good beans, nuts, those are all good sources of protein, but you need to, again, um, work with your dietitian. So your diet is critically important to your health and to maintaining your strength to be able to cope with your condition. So it's important, but so are the limits. So good luck to you and have another chat with your dietitian to figure out maybe there's some other um, meal ideas that he or she can give you that really will help.